climate change impacts in Guyana are intensifying as evidence from changing weather patterns such as warmer temperatures, more intense rainfall and rising sea levels. Guyana is already naturally vulnerable to floods, high tides and swells, as close to 75% of the country's population, capital city Georgetown, other major towns, crops and infrastructure are all located on the low coastal plain. Extreme weather events interacting with these exposed and vulnerable human and natural systems can lead to disasters causing destruction, loss of life and major economic losses as recently seen in Guyana. The government of Guyana and the Civil Defense Commission with the support of the international donor community have taken several steps to improve disaster risk management in the context of climate change adaptation. These include the IDB-funded project to strengthen national capacity for integrated disaster risk management through policy, legislative and institutional strengthening, mangrove restoration project to protect the coastline, the conservancy adaptation project to rehabilitate the dams, and the new Hope Canal project, which will upgrade and increase the capacity of the network of cocos canals and sluices to drain the coastal lowlands more efficiently. Disaster risk management has to be mainstreamed at all levels, hence the CDC is urging a national effort to reduce the risk posed by floods. Starting now, please dispose of your garbage in bins and not carelessly everywhere. The garbage blocks the drains and causes the water to overflow on the plains. If you are building your homes or business place, obey the building codes and do not build over or near to the canals. Be responsible. A message from the Civil Defense Commission.